Hello, Internet, and welcome back to a new and artsy episode of Pike's Adventures in Santa Monica. Well, um, we're in the art gallery, and as you know, Jeanette told us to slash the paintings. And I think she's uh, setting us up. Oh, there's the, uh, there's the charity box. I said I wouldn't, won't take it, so I'll take it. <laughs> I lied to what? her. Dip, dip, da. Oh, no loss in humanity. Okay. Well, anyway, as I was saying, um, this uh, is kind of a strange thing. At first, of course, you think, okay, painting's about. Cain and the curse must be painted by a Cainite and most probably a Toreado because they are into arts. On the other hand, this thing is guarded by magic, as you can see. This is a painting. I shot a hole into it. I'm shooting holes into all of them. No effect. Now, let's try something else. I'm supposed to slash them. Why not a sword? Katana. No, Shin Gunto. Shin, Shin Gunto. Shin Gunto does absolutely nothing. No, nope. it has to be a knife. So, obviously, either this is not a normal knife, or the paintings are somehow ooh, protected. So must be a canine painter who knows something about magic. Not a setite, clearly. He wouldn't paint shit like that. Um, not an Asimite. He wouldn't care about cane either. Um, not so much. So only leaves a Tremere, I'm afraid. Oh, God. Tremere, who's into arts. So, I know the riddle, of course. You have to slash them according to the timeline. So, first, Cain slays Abel, which is nasty. Therefore, he gets cursed by God, who is actually responsible for the whole thing because he made Cain the way he is, and he turned down his offering, which was nasty. So, he actually initiated the whole thing and God is a tree on fire hmm all right why not but then again Cain meets Lilith which is kind of weird because actually Lilith was the first wife of Adam so it's his daddy's lover not so nice and then Cain spurns Lilith not so nice either but there we go now for the second problem. Whoever made these pictures is into magic, as we already ascertained, and he created a blood guardian. So definitely a Tremere. Now we have several problems with that. First of all, the guy was an imbecile because he created his blood guardian thus that it would only appear after all the paintings have been destroyed, which leaves nothing to guard actually second of all the problem that occurs here is mine because I said I only would use uh, guns and against a liquid enemy guns are massively useless but we'll try it nevertheless um, and we'll coordinate that with disciplines Oh. Uh, oh, this guy is fast. You don't have eyes. Not really. Oh. Uh. Ouch. Oh, 
Oh, not good. It's not going too well. Okay, that hurts him, but not very much. Whoa. Run, 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 run. There we go. Ow. I don't get anything back. That's nasty. Uh, let's try a blood pack. And go for purge again. Where is he? There you are. Oh, no. This is not so easy. Give me the gun, gun, gun. Ouch. Run, 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 run. Gun. Oh. Another blood pack. Man, it's. I must admit, using the Shingunto here makes a lot more sense. Gun! Ouch! Ow! Twice! Got me twice! Not good, not good, not good. Run, 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 run! One more blood purge, I guess. Where is he? Where is he? Where, where, where is he? Can't see him. Oh, there he is. Ow. Gun. Uh oh. Okay, I'm totally out of blood. So I guess I'll just have to shoot at him. Uh oh. Oh, come on. He's almost. Almost. Oh, no, 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 no. Ow. Uh, oh, 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 oh. Ow. Ow. Oh, so close, so close. Come on. Yeah, we did it. We did it. We did it. With a gun. With a gun. Whoa. That was tough. Quest complete. Ah, uh, quest lock, quest lock. You retrieved the pendant from the ocean. No, 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 no. Uh, bap, bap, bap. Uh, you should check back later to talk to her when she returns. Okay. Oh, oh, yeah. You slashed the paintings in the gallery for Jeanette, possibly making some kind of statement in the process. <laughs> okay, so I guess I I'll go back. I'll go back to the asylum and um, hopefully Jeanette's gonna be happy and show me where Bertram is or Therese is there and um, well <sighs> she's probably happy about the locket but probably not so happy about the paintings because I I just know she has something to do with the whole thing. <laughs> ah, damn it. There was an art coordinator in her email list. Oh, I hate these alarms. Oh well, nothing we can do. Let's just go in there and ride the tide. But strange, huh? Why would you... Oh, this DJ sucks so bad. Oh. Oh, 
always the same song. God damn it. I already know that newspaper. So, must have been some kind of crazy artist creating a blood guardian that appears when the paintings are ruined. Great idea. Oh well. You. What were you thinking? I knew it. About, um... The museum. That was my event. Did you think I wouldn't find out? Okay, just wait a minute. Your sister told me. Shut up. I thought I could control my sister as long as Tongue was out of the picture. But nothing's changed. I should have expected that you'd succumb to Jeanette's influence like all the others. But how dare you! I didn't do it, I swear, is absolutely out of character. I would never say that, so I'm not saying it. Listen, honey, she told me. How was I supposed to know? Get together with your sister and fight it out with her. Don't lie to me! Jeanette already confessed she tricked you into doing it. It was probably all Tongue's idea. I'll deal with them later. But that's still no excuse for you ruining my museum. I swear I didn't do it. I even brought you the item from the Ocean House here. Okay, so seemingly my character is more um, of a diplomat than I thought he would be. So, all right. No choice. Excellent. I'll take that. However, Jeanette claimed you did it for her, but let's say I believe you. After all, you've acted decently and rationally up to now. I imagine you'd still like me to call off the feud. Yes. There's only one problem. If Tongue gets word that I threatened Jeanette, which he most certainly already has, it's not likely he'll believe me. So, in order to call off the feud, you're going to have to convince Jeanette to forgive me first. <sighs> I'm inclined to say forget it, but I guess I have to. She's my only way to tongue now because I don't even know where Jeanette is. I made some threats against my sister. Idle threats involving fire and her impious satin sheets. <laughs> she took them quite seriously and is avoiding me. I want to meet with her and explain that they were said in the heat of the moment. The moment I asked her to meet me at the Surfside Diner to reconcile, but I'm busy with the club and my other endeavors. I'd like you to go to the diner and promise her that I don't plan to take any action against her. Wait for her in the back booth near the phones. <sighs> Why don't I just kill the crazy bitch so this never happens again? Jeanette is my sister and my child, or did you forget? What kind of monster would I be to condone such action? You have no more right to do such a thing as you do to even ask it. Go! Get out of here! I want her back. <sighs> you want to be soft, that's your business. I'll go meet her. See ya. God, what a wimp. Okay. Back into the... Loud... Uh. Well, go. Hello? Uh. Yeah, what's inside of you? Hey! <laughs> that was the that was the guy from the museum, huh? Partying, huh? Right. Cool. <laughs> His name is Chunk, by the way, and we'll meet him again later. So first of all, man, these these two Malkavians are driving me crazy. Which is uh, probably according to their plan. <laughs> I need some more blood. Where's the crazy guy still waiting for his tow truck? Here he is. Good, good, good. Walk all the way. All the way. All the way. Yep. Good, good. Excellent. Mm, yum, yum. Oh, more and more. Ooh, blood, 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 blood. Yeah. 
Oh, I feel a lot better. A lot better. Thank you. All right, then. Uh, I've got 15 experience points. <coughs> I want uh, sleep. And I want my... Uh... Oh. Uh... Anyway, oh. Oh, police. Two police cars. Officer. Crime scene. Gonna have to ask you to step back, please. What's going on here? Uh, some lunatic broke into the gallery and slashed up the paintings. Everyone's a critic these days, huh? Up. Uh, I just hope they catch the guy, a person who did this. Bye now. <laughs> Well, how come you're wearing sunglasses? Guys, it's raining. It's the middle of the night. You don't have to pretend to be that cool, okay? <laughs> oh. And uh, by the way, may I, uh, may I get your attention? May I point out this, um, hello? Ah. <laughs> Unbelievable. Ah, uh, let's see, uh, Mercurio. See how he's doing, huh? And you didn't, you still didn't clean up here? Uh. I had some questions about Santa Monica. Specifically? Um, uh, tell me about some of the power players in Santa Monica. Who exactly? Um. Tell me about yourself. What's to tell? I can get anything anyone wants at any time. You could say it's my calling. Till the astrolite. Wasn't anything I couldn't handle. Well, back east some shit went down. Big Apple can't go back. I hate LA, but what are you gonna do? <laughs> okay. I had some other questions about Ooh, people. Exactly. Tell me about Jeanette Vorman. Therese... Therese I don't like, but I can respect her. Jeanette's different. I don't know what to make of her. She's a little, you know, in the head. I don't know. Therese is, well, like you. And I would think so's Jeanette. But I hear rumors about her. Rumors. All right. Jeanette got a body built for bedrooms. And I got close acquaintances says they conquered that territory. But I asked the main man, and he says you types, you know can't or don't or do that kind of thing. Anyway, whatever she is, I hear Jeanette's a wild girl. Interesting. Goodbye. So, she's still having sex? <laughs> That's kind of funny. Um, and actually kind of weird because, well, for a vampire, that shouldn't be interesting. <laughs> Ah, uh, well. That didn't help very much, but... Ah, uh, trip. Let's get some ammunition. I think I'm running low after that one. Man, it's really hard to kill that blood guardian with bullets from a bee shooter. Hello? Uh-oh, what was that? Uh, game just bugged out on me, I think. I was kind of stuck and couldn't open the door. Let's try that again. <sighs> Don't fail on me now. Ah, good. Hey there. Thanks for coming back. What you need? Your blood. I oh, know. Sorry about that. Like to buy something. All right. Here's what we got today. Okay. I need some ammunition. Okay. Uh, you can have the knife. You can have the shin gunto. Because I'm not using it. You can have the crossbow. Well, actually, that is a shooting weapon. But, nevertheless. For seven bucks, man. Okay. You can have a gold ring. Bail bond. No. 
Anything else? Charity money? You can have the cash box for five bucks. What's that? It's a diary. It's worth nothing. Purse. Oh, that's uh, that's Lily's purse. Yeah, you can have it. Uh, drug box. Oh yeah. Yep. 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 Another diary. Uh, I guess that's all for now. Bye. See you later. So, I guess we're ready to go to the diner and talk to Jeanette and, um, well, tell her that she hasn't any reason to fear for her satin sheets. <laughs> It was all a mistake. <laughs> yeah, sure. Oh, anyway. There's the diner. Oh, turn off the alarm. All right, I'll be signing off now. See you again tomorrow.